The stage is set and the prospect mount watering. Two teams at the peak of their powers ready for a battle royal, serving as a true gauge of their ability to perform under pressure. Only one team can come out on top. Who will it be? Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from London here on EA TV. will test the mentality of any footballer. I think we might just have witnessed the unstoppable penalty. And he finds the net he could hardly miss. Can he remain calm? Superb placement there. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. Can he keep us cool? He had to score, and he does. He's gone for the Panenka, but he might be wishing he hadn't. Job done from the spot. So much on the line with regard to this penalty. And there it is, perfectly executed. And now a heaven-sent opportunity to win the match. Engulfed by all the pressure, he nevertheless puts it away to win this penalty shootout. Well, it's a good penalty. He showed a lot of composure there. And overall, they probably just about deserve to win this game. Delighted to be able to report very agreeable weather for the fans here at the Emirates Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Arsenal up against Marseille. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Arsenal's free kick here. <laughs> well, straight into the meat of the penalty area. Danger averted. Asadin Unahi. Now Vertu. Plenty to like about Martin Odegaard, his approach to the game, his ability on the pitch. What do you expect to see from him in this match? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Well, he's given us away. Samuel Gigo. Jonathan Close. Kondogbia. And on the ball, Mbemba. Gigo. The ball with Kondogbia. Mbappe Holland on to Mbappe and that's a corner And over it comes. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And making sure it wasn't problematic.
and possibilities inside the box Jorginho it is now with Jorginho Ronaldo Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Great defending! And the counter-attack is on, options available. Really annoying for them, couldn't take advantage. Ben White. Now with Jorginho. Ronaldo might lead to a chance. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. The ball back with Marseille now. Condogbia. It's with Erdogan. Ben White. And back to Messi. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Oh, that's a fine-looking pass. Really sound defending. Jorginho! Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Well, opting for the short corner. Deciding to go inside. Has a go. Foiling his opponent completely. Terrific piece of anticipation. The body's forward and the break looks on. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the home of Arsenal. Well, he was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, he struggled to have any real impact on the game. I think if they are to kick on in the second half, it's key that he sees a bit more of the ball. And hopefully with that, he can start to put that back line under a bit more pressure.